What's up guys? Welcome back and today I am bringing you something that I think is pretty awesome. I'm sure most people have never even heard of this game. Uh, this is 2001's Sega Bass Fishing Duel. Now, a lot of people might think, why the hell are you playing this? Well, let me tell you. This game is amazing. It might not look it graphically, but I promise you, if you're a fan of fishing, this game at the time was the greatest. We used to play this constantly with my dad. Uh, my brother and I would play this all the time because he was a semi-pro fisher for some time uh, in one of the local you know, tournaments all the times. Um, we have always enjoyed fishing. It's something I still to this day love to do. And this game was the best. It was just so much fun. Uh, so I thought continuing the original hardware PS2 throwbacks I wanted to show you guys this game and I'm gonna be uh, jumping into just a basic tournament showing you some of the game mechanics and hoping to land some big ones here uh, so yeah let's jump in press the start button this game's awesome um, you get to kind of customize your fisherman or fisherwoman a little bit. Um, really all I'm going to do is just switch his clothes to reflect the hindrance gaming style here. You don't get to choose your name. There's three other fishermen. Um, well, currently only three that you can unlock. But uh, I think there's quite a few more. But for now, that's how we'll do it. It's looking good there. Alright, so. We're going to jump into a tournament. This is the very first one. you got to qualify for these other ones here. And we're not quite there yet. So, Amateur series. top in. So, it's a three-day tournament. Basically, catch five fish is the limit. Heaviest five fish win. It's the way it is in a lot of professional tournaments. Of course, this is a video game. Uh... Yeah. Do we need to practice? Practice? Y'all talking about practice? First stage. <laughs> Little AI one. for you. Alright. So let's go. Let's, let's let's just start here. We'll go to the beaver docks, you know. So, these are timed. Um the time if I remember goes like really fast. So you have to Use your boat controls here and just do some scouting, find some good ones, and land them. Heaviest five fish win. Uh, the mechanics are a little hard to get to know at first, but it's fun. It's it's definitely going to show its age. I mean, this is this is a 2001 game, you know, but uh, lots of fun, lots of fun. Back her up a little bit right there. Alright, there. Right. So we're gonna throw up in here and see uh What's that button? There it is. <laughs> see what's going on. Alright. Oh you know what I meant to I meant to adjust my gear here. I mean this is a decent choice, just throwing a standard crankbait, but I wanted to. There it is. And we'll go. We'll go with a nice chartreuse with the uh, you know spinner bait here. So we'll cast this bad boy out here. It's coming near. Don't All right, let so it, it drops in, as you can see. And so for these tournaments, it's all about. Fish. Boom! Didn't even get a chance to explain it. It's all about catching bass. Um, it's it's all about bass fishing. You know, it's like a bass fishing duel. Uh, the crappy you see swimming in the background there. You can catch those for your pride, I guess, of reeling something in, but they do not count towards the weigh-in. Um, as you can see on the right here as I'm reeling this thing in, you got to keep an eye on the line tension as you're trying to bring him in because he's shaking violently, so it, it could come out on its own just because it's doing that. Um, but obviously, if you're... 
pulling too hard and he's pulling one way, that line's gonna snap. So. And that's just basic fishing. That's nothing special. Could be again. This is what's hard. And he nails it first try. You gotta get it in that thing and you can. That was a big one. That was almost eight pounds. Let's go. Awesome start. Put him in the live well there. Keep things nice and healthy. So what's hard about when you go to reel them in, uh, to catch them, is that bar moves and you can steer the rod and you can turn it left, right, try and get it there. But then it starts to move a little quicker and if you miss, it'll say miss and it pops up all loud, like <laughs> really debilitating. And then you have, uh, it, it goes back out further, like the fish goes out like a good eight yards or something like that and you're like, oh great, you know back to square one here so uh, it's, it's it doesn't help you want to try your best to obviously to not miss um, so yeah I'm throwing a spinnerbait here which is something in real life I always love to throw because it's kind of basic it's just you don't have to do any special tricks with your casting or anything it's just throw it throw it out and reel it back which is good because I'm rather impatient with uh, like silly things or I guess non essential things I have issues with patience yet with people I tend to have the patience of a saint so I mean, that's what that's what people say you know I don't, I'm not out here to toot my own horn we gotta find some fish here. Ladies and gentlemen, we need some more fish. Oh, I was trying to throw it past up into the corner. Oh well. It's coming near. Nope. Let it go. Nope. Don't need one of those. No, there's no bass over here. We gotta Come on now, throw it out deep. There we go. I need to get up into it's coming underneath here. the docks Don't if I can. Go. I mean, anything you catch is uh, good. You know, I need to get five fish, but you want to win, you're gonna need them all to be big ones. This one, I bet you'll not even be three pounds. But fish is a fish, as far as I'm concerned, when you're trying to get five. So the goal is to. Fill the live well with five at first, and then swap them with bigger fish as you're able to. Look at that. That's a small one. That's a small one. <laughs> Still. Let's, let's try and get fancy. Let's do that. That was cool. There's all kinds of neat stuff you can do with it's this. Um, here. Don't let it nope. go. There. It's gone. We gotta move the boat. We gotta get out of here. We have fished that spot pretty clean, in my opinion. Turn the boat, turn the boat. There we go. Let's throw. Out here, let's go. There's a good one. Do you see that back in the corner there? That one's a good one. I gotta try and get out that way to get that one's attention. I don't see any of these. Nothing. I want to move the boat real slow because driving this thing, it takes a lot to get used to it at first. Coming near. Oh, Don't look at that. Go. We landed right in his wheelhouse. It's gone. No. Yes. There we go. That crappy went to get it, and I just jerked the line real quick to get him out the way. And I guess the, the big bass here really like that, so <laughs> let's get him on. Please don't get off the hook. I need this. This is another good one. This is probably like, I had to guess, this one's a good 
Seven, eight pounds. Don't break the line. No! Oh, come on! Oh. And there's no guarantee it's gonna swim back it's out here. Sometimes they do, Don't but go. a lot of times if you miss it, that's all she wrote. That's terrible. Oh. It's gone. That's how you win the tournament with with a cast, you know, like that. It's coming near. Don't let it go. <sighs> Had to get fancy with that one. Do a little underhand. Fish. We just got to get fish in the boat right now. I cannot believe I lost that one. That's going to be terrible. It's the it's the most weight I think on all three days. So like um, when I was practicing, I, I did play this once. I played, so I can't say I haven't played this in 15 years, truthfully. I did play it yesterday, just trying to remember the controls. Um, and on day two, I actually won. I had like 38 pounds of one five fish. Like, they were all huge. And, uh... Yeah, you. I didn't win much. Like I it's won like. Coming near. Don't let it go. I think they gave me like a a lore as a new fishing lore as like a prize for winning day two, but I didn't win the whole tournament, so I did not unlock anything further. I didn't get like any. You can unlock more items for your character. And, um, you know, I think it's just more colors and like a like a different hat or something, you know. Nobody plays this game for custom fishermen. You know. Alright, please stay on. Come on now. Yes! I think this is the same one that swallowed the lore earlier. Look at that, 710. Huge. Just about 8 pounds. See, now we need, we got, we still got some time. I need to swap out some of the other ones. Obviously, I need to catch, uh, fifth fish in total regardless but if we can then swap out some big ones for them it's small guys here. don't let it go what's that there's two big ones right there i gotta get this in quick reel it in reel it in gotta move up it's the boat gone. oh ooh. <laughs> not good It's coming near. Bang, look Don't at that. Go. That's the one right there. I need him to bite it. Fish. Yes. Look, there's three in there. Oh, man. There's three big ones. Don't break this line. Please don't break this line. I need all of them. Look at him fighting, that's a monster. That's why I always thought this game was so much fun. Like they just really bring it to you. It's, it's so realistic in terms of like... 10-13, are you kidding? Look at that thing. My god. 28-5 is already excellent, and I've got two one-pounders in the live well. I'm gonna swap them here it's coming near cuz i know go. i saw a couple more big ones there's one that one's a another good one Bitch. and then there's that one back there to the right look at that how quick that was that one hiding back under there Last one. so i got to cast a little more to the right um and I think I might move the boat up a little just so I can do my underhand cast and get it closer. Alright, I'm running out of time. The time is at 14.13, so I'm not going to have much time to get that. Um, but so what we do there is we take the five pounder, we swap out the one pound fish. Uh... 
Come on, man, throw it. It's coming near. Don't let it go. Last 30 minutes. He's over there, he didn't even see it. <sighs> well, I think this one is still bigger than the one pounder I have, so even catching that is an upgrade. It's a medium. 211. Alright, so yeah, that didn't do much. Drop the speed. Last 10 minutes. Forward. It's coming near. Don't let it nope. go. Nope. Nope. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't have bothered with that other one, but... Oh, I mean, I think that's still a great total. I don't think I won, though. I think that's, that's going to be like a nice top five finish or something. Oh. Okay. Look at them things. The Bassmaster Classic here, look at that. Day one result, 33 pounds, 14 ounces. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, second place. That, you know what, that's all right. That's awesome. The end of day one. Yeah, we're gonna save tournament data, are you kidding me? that PlayStation 2 eight eight megabytes all right that's all you got <laughs> Can you imagine we've got what second stage uh, day one 90 gig updates for games now I think I want to go Deer Creek because I don't know why I just felt like we should I don't remember anything about the lakes aside for there's one where it's like and I don't know if I have to unlock it or if I already have them but there's one spot you go to fish where it's like heavily uh, lush there's a lot of grass everywhere you feel like you're fishing in the bayou like it's kind of weird but it's also really Enjoy cool your fishing. okay alright let's go up here Go with a big cast. Time it's is money. Here. Don't let it go. Okay, decent ones up under there. It's gone. Gonna keep it away from him. It's gone. Yeah, not good. I gotta. I gotta be careful with this because if you. If you switch to the underhand, it doesn't throw it as far, so you have to move up, you know? It's coming near. Don't if I wouldn't have hit go. the post. It's alright. There's two good ones there. I think they're gonna be mediums. I think that's like a three... four pounder. Problem is, as well, like, that's a really far... There's a good one. Um, what?! Oh man! It's gone. It's I gone. Didn't, what he miss it? Come on, man! That is just the worst. It's coming near. Terrible luck. Don't let it go. It's gone. Oh my god, just hit it. It's gone. Come on, you are killing me with this right now. We are wasting it's coming near. precious time. Don't let it go. I don't even know why. I guess like I stopped for a second like I wasn't reeling. Um, because I didn't want to... 
I didn't want to have too much tension for it to come off, and I think the line snap, that was crazy. Alright, said he, he threw the hook off. Um, I guess you have to keep some level of tension or he'll just keep thrashing and, you know, and catch it carefully. break free. Oh, he got a big 8.15. That's a good start. A little later than I had wanted, but that's great. It's I think I needed near. to throw. Don't let it go. No, that's a good one. I was gonna say I thought I needed to throw left more, but it's gone. What? It's coming near. Don't let it go. Are you coming after it or what? up in here, see what's going on in this neck of the woods. It's coming near. Don't let it go. I can't see. Nope. It's gone. Don't need that. All right, so definitely need to throw. If he doesn't hit the post, that's it's a coming yep, near. Hit the post. Don't let it go. Still a good spot. Now, if we can keep him on the line. This is awesome. I don't know how many people would even want to play something like this. Like, I guess if you're into fishing and like arcade games, because I'm pretty sure they made arcade cabinets out of this game specifically, the uh, Bass Fishing Duel. Um, but it's awesome. I've played newer fishing games, and I know I know it's it's uh, nostalgia glasses to a degree, but something about it is just like it's so simple, but yet uh, specific and here. don't you know, let it go. It's gone. Uh, I don't know how to say it. Just like it's complicated and sophisticated enough while still being simple that it's just right like they didn't try too much but they still it's not simple enough that it's boring i feel like a lot of games in general not just fishing games but they try too hard it's gone and with this one i don't think that's the case i think it's just good it's coming near. that's a good one back don't there I don't know if... Oh, he's... Man, he wanted that. Did you see that? That was a good haul. Now that... The fish I was originally chasing is bigger, but... We've only got two in the boat, so... Every little bit helps. Although, from what I've seen, if I want to win, I need, like... 36 pounds? Which means you gotta... Every single one has to be a big fish. It's a medium. 3.15 is not bad. That is not bad at all. I mean, you know, finish it off with two more 10 pounders and you're at 37 pounds, so. It's coming near. Don't let it go. It's Come gone. on now, turn around, I'm right here. Got him. Five yards away, I mean, he's going backwards, but. That's a a lot closer because sometimes you'll like depending on the lore you use you can like haul it out there to where you're like 30 yards away and if they bite it that's a battle man you don't have time you're timed for this <laughs> I meant to throw underhand although I don't know Post. I think that might be all she wrote for that spot. We gotta go, we gotta go. I don't have time to be searching. I need him in the boat. We'll do like... Well, that's not what I wanted to do, but... We'll do a quick scout, because 23 is not gonna do it. It's not. All 
I don't even see anything. Like, I saw, like, one. But that's a small one. Yeah, that's not... This is just wasting my time. Careful, careful, don't wreck the boat. That's where I want to go. You see them lily pads back there? That's a good spot. It's coming near. But I can't don't deny there might be something here. Just not that. It's gone. Anywhere you can see like some type of growth or something, that's a good spot to look in. It's coming near. Don't let there it go. There you go. It's gone. That's a good one over there to the left. It's gone. It's coming near. Don't yeah, let it go. there's a good one. It's gone. Back in that right corner. Bitch. That's the next. I'm gonna reel this one in, and that's the one we're going for. That one in that back right corner is a monster. Right there. See him back there? I mean, I gotta pull this one in, but... And we gotta start... Oh. No! Ah... Uh. Is this the one that just came off? Because that's, thankfully, the one that is on the hook right now looks bigger than the other two, but I still gotta find that one. I just saw it in that far right corner. It looks like it's even um, farther right than I thought. Look at this thing. This is a good one, too. I would like to show that, like, while I'm playing this right now, it's the first time um, I'm landing each one. When I was in practice, learning uh, the controls, I missed here. bringing in the fish a few times. Come on, get the big one, come on. No! Break the line, break the line, I don't want it. Come on. The wrong one bit it. This is not good. And I, I'm actively trying to break the line right now, just holding in the trigger. Uh, and catch it carefully. I mean, if it adds to the total, cool, but... Oh, he got a big one! I mean, that's... If that's a big one at 7, that other one must have been, like, 13 pounds or something? That thing was a monster compared to this one. You can see its shadow. A big one's close He's right by. there. Be Come on. When you go for it. We're running out of time. Last 30 minutes. Oh, he spit it out! It's gone. He's right there. Throw. I don't have. I'm not gonna have time. It's I bet you. Here. Don't let it go. Oh my. Look, I'm gonna hold it in the buttons and try. There's no way. Come on. Do you guys understand how frustrating that is? That is twice that's happened to me. All off cam when I was practicing, I caught... There, there's select ones you'll find like in the lake, like I guess preset or whatever, where it'll be like, there's a big one nearby. And that's like the trophy to try and catch. I'm not saying a 10 pound fish is not great, but that one's probably like 13 or something ridiculous. So have missed it and e yes catching a seven pound fish was not a bad thing but look second place again I mean I'm right there I'm right there if I win this third day like it's mine you know it's mine for the taking third stage Lake day Eagle. One.
We're going to go fish at the dam. See how that does. I need to be quicker. And can't be making mistakes. If I would have landed, like, there was two that broke off, I think, in that. And I would have had more time to go after the, the biggest one. But, uh, yeah, I was recently just camping uh, with my girlfriend, my brother, and a bunch of us. And we went fishing at a lake that I Enjoy used to always fishing. go to as a, you know, as a kid. Uh, and I kept thinking, you know, I was going to be a big man and be all successful, use all my dad's, you know, knowledge and catch some fish. And it was so hot. I don't know, you know, where it is for everybody else, but it was like... 90 some degrees and you know in northeast it's, it's like there's Don't no such thing go. as dry heat Fish. like it's just so much humidity it's unbearable so naturally we didn't catch any fish not like that one two fives to start in almost no time i'll take it wow i hit the straight bottom floor there it's coming near don't let it go. I mean, that's a fish, but we need them big ones. We're going to win. Hook your fish. I'm going to reel it in because i got to get fish in the boat. But Stay calm and catch it carefully. Come on. Yeah, so we probably spent a good... Small one. I don't know how many hours. Let's say like six hours on the boat. You know, boat days nothing now granted we didn't get out there till like 10 o'clock in the morning and you want to catch anything it's when it's that in. hot you gotta go, go way it's early gone. or go out at like six you know you gotta nobody wants to be doing anything when it's that hot not even fish look at that you can see some of them swimming around right through the water Take it. We're gonna just keep going for some some quick strikes if we can. Oh, I missed. Oh, that was not good. Can't be wasting time. Not for these little guys. Just throw it out there. I thought I saw one. Right there. I thought I saw a big one back there somewhere. It's coming near. Don't let it go. Bitch. Got him. Don't break that line. Don't break that line. Like we're not even it says hour is at seven twenty. And we've got four fish in the boat. That was quick strikes. Now, um, whoops. I saw a big one just a second ago. I don't know where he went. This is just a guess. I'm pretty much just gonna use that cast as a scout because I don't know where it went. Here. Come on. How did I lose him? I just saw it. That's a good sized fish, too. It's one I need. I can't waste too much time here, though. Like, I need to keep rolling. Final day. I thought I would see something. There's. There he is. Look at him. Oh, he's right to my left. I just saw it like as I threw it out there. That's alright. You got big plenty of time. By. Be careful when you go for it. It's constantly moving. 
gotta find that rock it keeps going to. It's coming near. Don't let it go. There is one. Is that him? Yes. Yes, that's the one. Look at it coming out of the water. This is a monster. That's the one I need. Get in the boat. Yes. Holy. Super big 12-3. Man can't even hold this thing. That's probably going to get me the big fish award too. Like I don't see anyone catching anything bigger than that. Holy moly. Ideas Mio. Alright. That was awesome, but now we gotta start swapping. I have five in the boat, and that thing that one fish is half of our total. So I think it's time to move the boat. I caught the big one. Move the boat throw out there. Might be a little close here. I just keep landing them on the bank. Where's everybody at? Oh. Holy. Let's see if we can get him. He's right near the boat. I might have to back up again. That's another monster. A big one's close by. Yes. Get in the boat. Come on. I need this. Yo, I'm I'm winning this tournament. And catch it carefully. I have to. This is just awesome. This is so much fun. 18-3? Are you kidding? What? I already won, and I just got so much time. I have four more hours. 40 pound 15. I'm almost at 40. There's no room for that thing. There's no room for an 18 pound bass in a live well that size. Oh my god. That's what's so great about this game, man. I remembered finding them like when I was little and like just freaking out because you'd never find a fish that big. Like it's it's awesome to see if a bass can get that big. Like obviously there's there's like tuna out there that can grow to like a thousand pounds. So yeah, obviously there's more impressive sizes out there. But I mean, come on. When people talk about bass fishing, you'll see like oh two pounds here, pound and a half, you know. But they can get that big, like. That's awesome. I don't even know where else to throw. I'm kind of just playing around at this point. I mean, no one's going to beat 40, almost 41 pounds. It's coming near. Don't let it go. It's gone. Fish. And I'm gonna add to it. That one's much bigger than the one pounder I've got still in the tank. And then I think there's like a two five was the start. Stay calm Let's go. And catch it carefully. That's another what? Eight ten pounder? Oh, he got a big one. Seven seven. There it is. Just running up the score. Just run it up. Can we do anything more? I still got another two hours and 20 minutes. Good old spinner bait never lets me down. All right, let's go over here. See what else we can find. Just play around. It's coming 
scrape in the bottom. Don't let it go. That's another good one. That's another good one. Right near the boat too. That's what I like. Bring it in here. Swap them out. Oh, we getting fancy to bring that one in. Three nine. All right, so that one was only barely heavier than the smallest in here yet, so. Gotta just keep looking for the big hogs hiding out here. They're out here and you can catch them. I mean, I got two of them in the tank right now. Let's move the boat. And throw that way. Last one hour. It's coming near. Oh my. Don't let it go. Hold on, hold on. Alright. Get back. Hurry up, hurry up. I can it's catch that gone. fish. Throw. There are some Don't massive fish hiding over it's here. Gone. There he is. He's going the wrong way. Damn it. It's gone. Fish. Oh, really? I'm going to waste my final minutes catching a crappy. Stay calm and catch it carefully. Crappy. <laughs> Not even a full pound. Last ten minutes. There he is, there he is. Close by. Another Be careful when you That was another it. super it's big. Here. Don't let it go. Not that these guys Find aren't up. a good size right there, but the monster one was looking at it. Alright, let's go to the way in. Let's uh let's show off here. This this definitely has to be my victory. Eighteen three destroyed. Nobody came close. Big Fish Award was ten points. Yeah, that's mine. Yes. Yes! That's awesome. Those 10 extra points sealed the deal. I, I don't know. I would have won without it. The guy only had 74, I think. You are the Sega Bass Fishing Amateur Champion. Let's go. Can't tell if that's just the graphics on my TV or from my man here who's got like a tiny little mustache. <laughs> that's so cool. I'm really glad to have done this while I was recording too. Not, uh, <laughs> not play as a scrub on camera. Alright, so we got a new shallow crankbait. Nice, anything else? Oh, cool. Another crankbait. Save tournament data. Absolutely. We're going to make good use of that 8 megabytes right there. Perfect. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. This has been Sega Bass Fishing Duel with your boy. Hope you enjoyed. I'm going to keep playing this, do some more tournaments because it's so much fun. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Peace.